Hello friends, in this video I'm showing you a couple of Dynamo graphs which will update pipe network detail from Excel. And all these graphs you can download from this video description. In this civil 3D model 3D view you can see pipes and structures. And here some of the structures not touching to the pipe and here some of the structures too below. So let me check this structure depth network structure properties and here some depth is zero. So we need to update all these structure depths from Excel. Let me open the Excel. Here in this Excel we have manhole name and each manhole depth and so as per this depth all the structure will update by using dynamo so let me check the structure name here in the prospectus excel name and the civil 3d name should be matched so in the prospectus network i can make sure all the structure name is matching with the excel then we have to open dynamo go manage then here in dynamo open dynamo then i can maximize here then open the dynamo graph so this graph will be dot dyn so i can select this dot dyn and this uh, graph you can download from this video description open okay so here is the dynamo graph which i developed and here in the browse you can double click then choose the excel file select double click and here in this string we have to give exact sheet name for this excel so my sheet name is fsm table to excel so should uh, match with here i have organized like three session here i'm taking all the information from the excel and those excel data i'm just organizing here here structure name so i need structure name from that data and here structure depth each required list i'm supplying from here you can see and uh, running this graph you need civil 3d toolkit if you are using first time dynamo then you have to go this packages search for package so it will take some time to get all the information syncing with server you can type civil 3d toolkit toolkit okay so here it's, if it is not installed you can click on this uh, down arrow i have already installed the civil 3d toolkit so after installation you can see here in the, uh, under the add-on you can see autodesk civil 3d toolkits and all the nodes will be available so before running this graph make sure you have installed civil 3d toolkit okay and so i have given all the required uh, fields here path I have updated and here I have given the sheet name also so after giving all these details uh, if it is not automatic mode then you can click on the run run button so the program will run and update the depth let me restore down to sh visually show you the changes okay so when i click on this run button all the structure depth will be updated okay let's see click on the run so here you can see all the structure depth updated okay now we can check another dynamo graph to rename all the pipes from the excel so we can check these pipes names so click on the pro under prospectors on the network click on the pipes so you can see all the pipes name here pipes 498 493 it's not in proper order so what i can do i can copy all these pipe names to excel and give the new name 
then uh, we can update through the dynamo all the pipes name from excel okay so i can select all shift end and right button copy to clipboard then i can open new excel okay and here i can paste everything okay here i need only the pipe names all others i can delete okay this name i can change old name okay and here i can give new names okay so here we can give maybe p001 maybe we can also give one underscore or iphone if required okay this should be two okay so double click on here and it will update all so in here i can type old name oh sorry new name okay so what we are going to do all these pipes uh, rename as per this second uh, column new name so I can save this excel the desktop I can save like book one and this name is sheet one okay just minimize now I can open dynamo here we have already opened so I can maximize and close this graph no now I can open new dynamo graph to rename the pipes pipe rename from excel so i can open this pipe rename from excel okay open so in this graph i have organized three sections same like before and here taking all the information from excel and here we are organizing and here supplying to the uh, nodes to rename the pipe name okay so here i can open the excel from the desktop which we saved recently okay and sheet name is sheet one is correct now i can run okay click run okay run completed now we can check the pipe names see it's updated all the pipes name is updated what we given in excel Thank you for watching this video, please like this video and subscribe my channel.